friends, Miss Vanessa here. It's circle time, but you might notice that I'm not inside today, I am outside. That it is such a beautiful spring day that I wanted to show you my backyard today for circle time. So go ahead and find a spot and get ready to join me. Come on everybody and find your spot, find your spot, find your spot. Come on everybody and find your spot. It's circle time. Hello again. Let's get started with our calendar. We know that we always start up here at the top left. And I see something special here. I see an F. It goes down and a line at the top and a line in the middle. So when you're singing our song, listen for a word that starts with a F, F an F sound. Let's get those clapping hands ready. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. There's Sunday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. When we were singing our song, did you hear a day that started with a f, an F? That's right. Friday. I can see this as fry and day. That Friday has two parts, two syllables. I can clap it and say Friday. That's awesome. Thank you for that. Friends, I wanted to do something special with our F for Friday. I wanted you to go around your homes or your yards and find some things that started with a an F sound. I'm taking my teeth and putting them on my bottom lip saying Friday. So go ahead and walk around and try to find one or two or three things that start with the word. Start with the sound. An F sound. I'll see you in a minute. All right, friends, what did you find? Hmm. I found some fruit in my house. I have an apple and an orange, and we know that they have their own names, but together they're called fruit. I'm saying fruit. And I also found a, a flower. You got it. This is a tulip with a pink top. And friends, there's also something I can't show it to you because I'm using my phone to record, but phone's a special word because it starts with a f sound, but it's actually spelled with a P-H. So that's one of those special sound combinations that it doesn't look like an F, but it sounds like an F for phone. Thank you for helping me find, oh, I just said another F word, find those ideas. So friends, we know it's Friday, and then we come down here, and I see a mmm, I see an M. That tells me that this word says mm -mm a May. That May is a new month. I don't think we've done circle time together since May started. Let's sing our month song. January, February, March, and April, May, June, July and August, September, October, November, December. Those are the months of the year. Thank you for that, friends. I want to think about this M with May. And May is kind of special because when I say May, there's only one syllable. There's only one part to May. I can't separate it like I did with Friday. So we're gonna do the same thing. I want you to go around your house and try to find some words that start with a f, f, oh, not an F sound for Friday, but an M, an M sound for May. Go ahead and take a look and I'll see you in a minute. All right, friends, what did you find? Any of those M, M sounds? I found a marker. And I also found some moose. This is stuff that I put in my hair. There's an M there for moose. I also found a piece of 
mail, something that the postman delivered, and something bigger down here in my lap. I found a mat. It's my front door mat, so when you come inside, dirt doesn't go all around the house. Thank you for finding those things with me. So we know it's Friday, May, and I see an eight here, but I also see a little TH because we don't say it's May 8th. We say it's May 8th. We put the TH on the, on the end. What do you think we can do eight of today? I'm thinking about nose taps and chest taps. So go ahead and get that finger ready and count all the way to eight with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Thank you for that. So we know it's Friday, May 8th, and at the bottom I see 2020. That's our year. So let's say it all together now. Today is Friday, May 8th. 2020. All right, friends, we're done with our calendar. Now it's time for the, the weather. That's right. And since I'm already outside, I don't need to walk to the window. I can just look up in the sky. So if you're outside, you can look up. But if you're inside, you can walk to the window and see what the weather is. What will the weather, the weather, the weather, what will the weather person say? What will the weather, the weather, the weather, what will the weather person say? Come on back and find your spot, friends. Preschoolers, when I looked up in the sky today, it's a little bit tricky because you might notice that I have my sunglasses on but the sun is actually hiding behind the clouds, that it is cloudy today. The sun's trying to peek out to make it a partly cloudy day, but it's still hiding back there. It's very gray skies today, so we know that it is cloudy. And if you're outside, you're feeling that the temperature is warm today, but if you're inside, it might be a little bit cool. And friends, we know that our season is still spring. It's not quite summer yet. It's not hot and it's not sunny, but it's still spring. All of the trees are still blooming. The grass is starting to get green and grow. And there are more and more flowers blooming outside. You might be able to hear some of the birds that are in my backyard. That That's also another sign that it's spring. Friends, thanks for joining me today. We'll see you next week.